10 people who died in the Thursday morning incident, 4 were children while the other 6 were adults. 3 others who sustained injuries and another 7 were hospitalized. An eyewitness, Okonla Wijusu, told Trust Television that the building was used to treat psychiatric patients. Mm. Although I was not at the scene, I was informed of the incident by our community vigilante group at 3 a.m. as the secretary to the community. I can confirm that the building's owner was a compassionate individual who ran an informal care center for people with mental health issues. At 3 a.m., we received an urgent call about the sudden collapse of Baba Ires House and we swiftly initiated rescue operations as of now, the cause of the collapse remains unknown. The Commissioner for Lands and Urban Development, Akin Fumilayo Williams, says the collapsed building was not meant to be occupied and announced that Governor Shiji Makinde has approved integrity tests for all buildings in the state. And, uh, we are here uh, on inspection and even to confirm <coughs> what has actually happened and equally commiserate uh, with the people in the community and the family affected. And uh, we've seen it. And uh, from what we all can see, uh, if I, I can put it in this way, the building is already distressed. It's uh, obvious and it's something visible even to the blind. The building is tired and nobody is supposed to occupy it. And to forestall occurrence of this <coughs> uh, ugly incident, that's why His Excellency uh, Governor Shea Makinde approved recently uh, what I will call uh, uh, building amnesty, whereby buildings in the state are expected to have a building approval. Uh, I can tell you without any search that this building affected doesn't have any building approval. And even from what I'm seeing within this community, uh, so many buildings are here that are distressed and I believe they don't have uh, any building approval. The incident happened as a result of um, the rainfall yesterday night during the thunderstorm as I've learned the building collapsed and um, it trapped a lot of people inside it was uh, this morning that uh, I was hearing that uh, that house is being used to take care of um, to heal some uh, to treat some uh, mad, mad people and uh, mentally the retarded um, people. And um, it made that also harbor many people. Meanwhile, the Oyo State Police Command says it has provided adequate security cover in the area to prevent Ulums from hijacking the incident scene and also protect the lives and properties of other residents within the area.